What's up? It's Anna, as you all know. Today I'm going to do the fictional boyfriend tag, or the book boyfriend tag, or just boyfriend tag, whatever you want to call it, in honor of Valentine's Day coming up. Considering I don't have any other Valentine except my fictional boyfriend, I thought it'd be kind of appropriate to do the fictional boyfriend tag in this beautiful little corner of my room on a chair. Okay, so here we go. I don't really want to delay this or anything because... Then I'm gonna talk forever and it's gonna be bad. And, but anyways, let's get into the video. Okay, so the first question I have on my little list thing that I made with all my little notes for this video in blue marker. Who is your most romantic boyfriend? And for that, I chose Edward Cullen from the Twilight series. And I'm breaking Dawn here and um... I know a lot of you guys are gonna be like, why is she doing this? But honestly, he was one of my very first fictional boyfriends that I truly loved, and so he just holds a spot in my heart for the romantic portion of this video. Edward is gay and stuff, and I love him, even though he's hated quite a lot, and I don't know why. I mean, yeah, he's a vampire and he sparkles, but I mean, you can't do that, so I mean, Who's the winner now, and who's the loser now? You're the loser, he's the winner. <laughs> I'm done with it. For the next question, question number two, we have who is dark and moody bad boy with a good side? For that, I chose Will Herondale from the Infernal Devices series. I just finished reading the first one, and I'll have that review up very, very shortly, maybe in the month of February or something. But I chose Will because although he does have his bad points in life and he's moody and amazing, he's amazing and so that's what counts, right? Because I fell in love with Will too soon. It's too soon. I, I, I need Will now and he's not given to me and I'm it's depressing. Someone needs to work on that. <laughs> Will. Next question, question number three, is your paranormal boyfriend, and for that I chose Evan Walker from the Fifth Wave series. Evan has always been my bae from the beginning. I fell in love with him, maybe a little too much, and so I think he definitely counts as paranormal because he's alien, and I think I like aliens a lot. Number four, four. You, which boyfriend do you want to tame? For that, I chose Thomas from the Maze Runner series because, um, as the novel goes on, he gets more and more insane. Like, mm. and then um, Dylan O'Brien and um, Thomas are the same person. And uh, I have a problem. I like both the characters way, way too much. Moving on! Number five, it's which boy you would friend zone. And because I actually do not have the Vampire Academy series on my bookshelf or in book form, and I actually have it on the Nook because I read it two, year, two years ago. And because of that, I was addicted to my Nook back then I sound so old it's only been two years and I calm down but I mean I didn't really think about purchasing the se purchasing the series along with all my books that I've like I would choose Adrian from the Vampire Academy series because if you guys don't know already I like Dimitri way more than Adrian so sadly I would friendzone him I mean gosh I love him I honestly love him so I would like him more as a friend. Question number six is who is your soulmate? I would choose Gideon Devier from the Ruby Red trilogy or Dmitry Belikov from the Vampire Academy series. These two, if you guys don't know, are my two favorite books ever. And my two favorite male fictional characters 
ever. These are my soulmates. I'm not choosing one because you can't choose one. Number seven is who are you going to elope with? And for that, I chose... <laughs> I chose Gideon and Dimitri. Don't judge me. Question number eight. Which boyfriend would you venture anywhere with? And for that, I chose Zamir's or Examir's or whatever you want to call him. Examir's. I don't even know. I'm going to call him Examir's because that's what I've always called him in my head. That's just how I've always pronounced it. So leave me alone. From the Ruby Red trilogy because he is probably my first boyfriend. Oh my goodness. I love him so much. And just to have him as a companion. My little gargoyle demon ghost best friend. And boyfriend and we just travel everywhere together and he'd like make a bunch of sarcastic comments and who needs a guy when you can have ex -Amiris? he forever remains my number one number nine it's which boyfriend you'd want to be stranded on the desert i lived with and for that i would choose percy jackson because if he's the son of poseidon he can conjure up water and things and he can catch fish brush and all of that stuff and yeah I mean, I'd be set with him. Plus, I love him a lot. Question number 10 is who is your most badass boyfriend? And I choose all of them. Just kidding. I choose Dmitry Belikov from the Vampire Academy series because he slays all of those Strigoi and things. So, I choose Dmitry Belikov from the Vampire Academy series for question number 10. Thank you all so much for joining me today on the Fictional Boyfriend book tag. And so I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you next time. Bye. I love you so, so much. Stay tuned for the next video and I hope I didn't fail too bad. <laughs> Bye.